Hello, this is Michael from Flying Steps. Here is KC. We are today here to make a little bit media things and uh, yeah. The founder of the Flying Steps, Amigo and Vatan, uh, they are still in Flying Steps right now. And uh, Amigo make a lot of uh, solo project. Vatan uh, is doing now the new show. So the premiere is in November this year. And um, yeah, I come into Flying Steps on 1994. So um, yeah, we are the last three uh, from the really old members and uh, yeah Benny Kumoto of course he come into on uh, 1997 he's also into the club and Casey is more than 10 years also now we are like almost 40 dancers like with the company flying steps company you know but uh, the old school like the the members is only five people When you g prepare everything for a competition like Battle of Zero or Red Bull Beat Battle, you have an completely another focus. You know the scene, you know what's happened about, uh, which movements are in the moment the craziest, and uh, then you f try to find something really special, but really what the people can understand from the scene. You know, when when I'm doing a six step. For the classical people, nobody will understand that, you know. But the scene at Battle of Year, when you make a crazy footwork combination, they go crazy. It means not really that we make the solos or the, the routines and stuff more simple for, for Red Bull Flying Bach. No, we, we make it with a lot of uh, creative things and we are thinking about how can we explain to people that breakdancing is not only a street culture, it's more than this. Breakdancing is no art, you know, it's an artful dance. And this is a, one of the things what we want to tell the people um, when they come in our show. Before the first show, I was scared. I was scared when I did Flying Bach. When in the beginning, I was really scared, and I was like, "Oh shit!" A lot of audience, and and now it's really. I did like this, but uh, normal. You know what I mean? But now, when I go to competition, I'm really scared. Like I'm really, I feel the energy, the audience, the power, the b-boys, the circle, the cipher. But this gives me motivation. You know what I mean? And this gives me back to go up you know and this is you know when when you saw a lot of people and you saw the all the cypher and and you, you have so much energy you know like Son Goku Dragon Ball <laughs> really good dancers they are really creative and they have his own character but the most of the dancers they don't have it you know and uh, to to get it back is really to take the focus on yourself and feel really what I want, you know. It's not important to make the craziest footwork combination. It's like how you feel when you do it. And when you f listen, uh, when you listening to your feeling, what do you have in your body when you are dancing, and you can understand that, then you come a little bit a step more forward to be more creative. Yo, each one teach one. This is uh, Michael Casey one. So we are from the Flying Steps, now here in Poland, and uh, yeah, b believe on your dreams, you know, that's what can I say you, um, stay true and, yeah. you know, 
all the time thinking go thinking about one level more and then one you will way, see go to your way and find your way you know right and this is really important have, and have fun you know what you do and love it what you do uh, yeah this is really important and we see you next time peace